on the floor this morning. So you're going to need, uh, well you don't need actually, um, I'm going to use a kettlebell, alright, so you don't need it, but um, be good if you've got something. So we're working through hip bridges, alright, so feet firmly on the floor, we're working through the heels to the shoulders, we're going to hip bridge up, alright, if you're using a resistance, we're going to press at the same time, alright, so we're hip bridging, we're then going to bring the kettlebell all the way to one side, so we're going to hip bridge, all right, and press. We're gonna hold that hip bridge up and press, all right? We're then gonna bring it to the other side and press on the other side too. Okay, so that's your third move. The last one, we're gonna bring the hips up and we're gonna extend the legs outwards, keeping the hips pushed up. Okay, so the first one is hip bridge and press. The second one, hips are up and it's an isolation or a, uh, a unilateral press, all right? So it's just the right side. We're gonna switch it to the left side. And then the last one, we're going to hold the kettlebell up or just hands by your side and you're going to extend the legs. Holding the kettlebell up is quite challenging, all right, because it reduces the floor coverage through the back. It just makes it a little bit harder. All right, straight after that, we're then going to go into a plank, all right, to batter, all right. So it's literally going to be back to back this morning, okay. So if you're ready, I'm ready, grab whatever you have got and let's get ready to rumble, yeah. Just sort out my volumes. I'm using Mrs. H's phone, so. A little different this morning. All right, here we go. So grab your kettlebells or weights if you're using them. Heels firmly on the floor. Heels to shoulder blades up. Now as you lower down, don't let your backside touch the floor, all right? Have a little sneaky look down your body. If you can see your knees, you're not pressing your hips high enough. Three, two, one, stop. All right, so we're going to bring the weight to one side. So if you're doing this without the weights, that is what I want you to do, okay? Five, four, three, two, one, All right, let's go. Push the hips up. Drive the elbow. Again, I'm going to look down your body line. If you can see your knees, you're not pushing high enough with your hips. Alright, can you hold your hips up just a little bit extra? Can you hold your hips up? Alright, let's go again. So you should be on the other side, yeah? Switch arms. Round three. Again, can you keep your hips up? So this one is your leg extensions. So kettlebell above us, or, or just your arms above you. Alright, extend, extend. You go hips up high. So halfway. All right, we're gonna go back to the start. Halfway there. All right, hips on the push. So again, heels to shoulder blades, nice and high. Try not to let your backside touch the floor. Push, like you're pushing the floor away from you with your heels. Oh. Okay. So just on one side, yeah? So deep line press, lift the hips, push it. Gain, little look down your body. Can you see your knees? You should be right on your shoulder blades. Heels firmly into the floor. Good, okay, keep those hips up, yeah? Keep your hips lifted. Push, push, push. Feel those glutes. Push. Good, 
guys, well done. All right, keep your hips up if you can. Oh. Glutes are starting to feel it now. All right, kettlebells up, so leg Three, extensions. Two, one, go. Push those hips up. Keep them lifted. As you're tiring, the hips will start to drop. You've got to keep it going. Alright, alright, quick pause. Alright, get that out of the way. So we're going straight into our next one. Alright, so that's our front planks. Alright, okay, so option off the knees. Alright, ideally we want to be off the toes, okay? So we're going to try and do this uh, off the toes as, uh, all the way through if you can, guys. If not, as I said, just work off the knees. We're going to add in some variations, alright, so stay with me. Hopefully you can see me, hopefully I've got enough room. Alright, let's go. So start off on your option. If it's off the knees, start there. If it's not, off the toes. Three, two, one, go. So elbows underneath your shoulders. Right, I've got my ankles together. If you want to make it a little easier, take them apart. Okay, rest. Okay, so this time, we just got to raise the arms. If that's too much for you, just do a hand tap. Try to keep your body still. Little rest. Hold. Squeeze your shoulder blades in. Okay, so that's our third one. Our fourth one. We're going to rotate. Rotate. Keep your hips up. All yeah, right, hold. All right, so this one, we're halfway there. We've got four to go. Try and stay on your toes all the way through. On the left. So remember your options, if you're here, stay off the knees, keep your back flat, shoulders in, stay here. Alright, so if you can, stay here, we're going to come into those side raises. Your options, just a hand tap if you're struggling. Run away. Woo. Can you stay with it? Can you stay off your knees? Stay on your toes if you can. So this one's just a hold. Getting tough now. Getting tougher, especially when you don't have those breaks. Hold it together. Alright, so the last one is those rotations. I'm gonna stay up, shoulders start to burn. Alright, let's go. Rotate. We're nearly there, guys, nearly there. Oh. 
and relax. Oh, good little stretch out through the back. Little child's pose. Bring yourself up. Reach up nice and tall. Did you stay on your toes? All right, if you didn't, rewind it, play it again and try it, all right? It just overloads your shoulders a bit more. Just makes that, obviously just makes it a little bit harder. So try it again, but stay on your toes for as long as you can, all right? T test yourself and challenge yourself. See what you can do. All right, guys, so that is me. That is you done for another day. Um, I'll see you later on this evening if you're joining us. All right, Fit, Fit ER members, uh, we've got Blast tonight. So join us for that one. I think it's Blast tonight. If it's not, I'll uh, let you know what it is. All right, guys, well done.